Nearly two dozen people are facing charges in connection with a four-month-long investigation into drug trafficking in and around Kennedy Plaza. Eyewitness News reporter Steve Nielsen joins us now live in studio with details on the bus dubbed Operation Bust Out. Steve? Uh, yeah, the Providence Police Chief said these are not high-level drug dealers, but he said what they're peddling may lead to overdoses and deaths. A four-month investigation leads to 23 arrest warrants. Serious charge. These suspects will all be charged after Providence police say they sold drugs to undercover officers in Kennedy Plaza out in the open in downtown Providence. The types of drugs involved that we purchased, the undercover purchased, were fentanyl, cocaine, heroin, oxycodone, and other pressed pills. Another outstanding investigation, four months of very, very hard work. Providence Mayor Jorge Alorza saying the operation, dubbed Bust Out, helps tackle the opioid crisis. One overdose death is too many. And we know that by taking these drug dealers off of the streets and taking every ounce or trace of fentanyl as we can off the streets, we're making sure that more people can stay alive. Chief Hugh Clement said travelers shouldn't feel uneasy in this part of downtown. Should they feel safe when they arrive at Kennedy Plaza? They should, knowing that we're on it and we do these type of operations. Clement said everyone charged already has a criminal record. Now, more than half of the suspects have already been arrested, but Clement said the others will be arrested in the next two weeks. All are Rhode Island residents. I'm Steve Nielsen, Eyewitness News.